Hey everybody, so I have decided to make a explanation video of a few things um, about my Sims 2 challenge. Uh, so I got some feedback I wasn't expecting to get. Um, I've got a lot of positive feedback, but I think I got more negative feedback than I did positive feedback. And so for that, I did went ahead and did a poll for you guys to vote on and it's been open for about four four or five days um i can't completely remember um yeah like three days actually and well here are the votes all like completely done and after i have closed the poll and stuff like that there was a total of votes of 301 and 218 of those votes were to get rid of the challenge and continue more of the 100 baby challenge. And the reason why I did this poll was, to, to be completely honest, I, I did want to continue this challenge because I wanted to play the Sims 2 challenge and, um, you know, I thought I was going to enjoy it. You know, there's ups and downs of playing the sims and i think a lot of you guys the reason why you guys were so negative about it was because it's a sims 2 it's an older game and um there was going to be a lot of raging in that challenge it is an orphanage challenge it's in the sims 2 the needs of the sims 2 sims are completely different than the sims 3 like they go down so fast and like I feel like you guys don't understand how it is to be behind that and having to worry about that. That's why it's a challenge, guys. It's not a let's play. It's not... Well, it's a let's play, but it's not like just your normal let's play. It's a challenge, and that's because, you know, the Orphanage Challenge for The Sims 2 is definitely a challenge. Like, the challenges for The Sims 2 are so much harder than The Sims 3 challenges, and I think that... You guys don't realize that and you guys were just mad that I decided I would do a Sims 2 challenge instead of a Sims 3 challenge and so on and so forth. So, I mean, just to keep my viewers happy because I got a lot of negative feedback and it's kind of taking me time to just be able to sit down and think of what I was going to do because a lot of your comments really made me hurt inside and that doesn't happen that often. Um, and, you know, it takes a while to get me down when it comes to, you know, comments because I, I know that you guys are just people and some of you guys are true fans and some of you guys aren't true fans. And I feel like looking at those comments, I finally found out who my true fans are and how and who my not true fans are because there are a lot of comments sitting there saying that one of the comments were... Maybe you should wait until you have babies in real life if you can't if you can't take care of some babies. Completely different. It's a game, guys, and I feel like you guys take real or the Sims into a whole different aspect of reality. You you play it like it's you know real life. Um, it's not real life. It's just a game, and to have someone sit there and tell me not to have kids yet and to wait later on to have kids that really made me really angry because one you guys don't know me and how i take care of kids in real life um i've been a babysitter and i think i have been one of a, a really good babysitter at that but i want you guys to realize that the sims is not real life people take it so seriously that it just it's infuriating and frustrating because you guys sit there and freak out. Oh my god, you let this sim die. Oh my god, you let this person in the red. Or the sim in the red. It's not real life, guys. If someone dies, someone dies. Like, if someone dies of electricity. If someone dies because they got caught on fire. If someone dies because they got hit by lightning. Come on, guys. It's not real life. Yes, all those things can happen in real life. But it's not real life. And I feel like... You know, I don't, I don't even know. Anyways, you guys need to stop taking The Sims so serious. And I don't know if it's because you guys, you guys are younger viewers. And I also got a comment saying that I need to stop addressing my viewers as all younger viewers. 
I'm not addressing all of my viewers. I'm addressing a fair, like, actually a fair amount. Like, a big, huge amount of my viewers are 13 to 17. And, I mean, 17 is a lot older than 13. But I do, and I, I, I have, like, 9-year-olds, 10-year-olds watching my videos, guys. A lot of my viewers are from 17 and under. And my viewers, I feel like, don't, I, 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 I just don't want to rant out about that anymore. My young, like my viewers are a young audience and I try and keep it appropriate for younger viewers. I try not to swear or cuss or do any of that. And when I get comments like that and I have so much stuff in my mind that I want to say, but I can't because I know that my viewers are going to go look, maybe read my comments, maybe see a comment from me that are like, oh, is that really Jessica? Like, is that really her true self, you know? Like, I try and keep it PG, and it's really hard when I get negative comments like that, because personally, I can get pissed off, and I, you know, I need to make sure that I keep it PG, because I'm 21 years old, um, I cuss, but I try and not cuss in the comments I reply to, in my videos I reply to, because I have younger viewers, and just those few comments that I got, there's plenty of other comments, like, plenty of other comments, but I, I could go on for days for that. But those few comments that I gotten really took a toll on me because, you know, that's not something you say to someone that you look up to or something, or you're a big fan of, or something like that. Like, that's not something you look, you say to you. I'm not saying the people that said that are not people that or my fans, I guess. I, I hate calling you guys fans. I honestly hate calling you guys fans. Um, but honestly, in reality, you know, I'm doing these videos for you guys. I, I need to not make, take things so light and like literal, I guess. I don't know. But I'm doing these videos for you guys. I did a poll and this is what happened. Um, People want me to make more babies in The Sims, apparently. Um, totally understandable. The 100 Baby Challenge is so popular right now. And I did a poll to be fair and not to just be like, I give up, you know? Because if I would have gotten more yes votes than no votes, I totally would have continued it whether or not I had those negative comments. But just because... I had those negative comments and everything. I did want to pull, put a poll out there to see what you guys think. And I wanted to sit down and think about it. And I want to put out stuff that you guys enjoy. I want to put out stuff that you guys want to, you know, watch. Instead of just getting aggravated at me and, you know, this, the game. And so I just wanted to post this video up. Explanation of why I'm doing this. Because I know a fair amount of you guys might get really mad that I'm ending it and saying, Oh my god, you never finish everything. I get it all the time. And I just wanted to put an explanation out there saying why I'm giving up on this and why I'm canceling it. And hopefully you guys understand. I mean, 301 votes, majority of those votes went to no. 218 votes. That's crazy. 72% said no and 27 percent said yes so obviously guys i'm going to go with the person or the people that you know voted no because it's just you know it's it's the right thing to do you guys don't want to see a sims 2 challenge i honestly don't know if i'm going to do a sims 2 challenge because of the fact that you know i did one and this happened um and another reason why I started up my second channel was because I wanted to branch out. I'm not just a simmer, I'm a gamer. I wanted to branch out and put out more content than just The Sims. And I don't want to get the negative Nancy sitting there, why are you doing this? This isn't your channel type of thing, you know? So that's why I started out my second channel. And hopefully you guys will watch that too, if if you want to, I guess. But um. I think I'm going to stop ranting now and just call it good. Um, so, from today, there will be no Sims 2 challenge. Um, the 100 Baby Challenge will take the spot of the Sims 2 challenge. And, yeah. Um, but, anyways, make sure you guys look at the description to my new channel. Um, subscribe if you want to. Watch my videos if you want to. Whatever. Um, and I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all in the next video. Bye, everyone.